Hello everyone, just heading out to the shops to pick up some fruits and veggies. It's absolutely freezing. So, like I always say, I walk, I try to walk everywhere that I go. So that's what we're doing. We are snacking on some cherries. Cherries? Yes, I managed to find some cherries. Is it? Oh, I'm just gonna quickly show you how I cut my okra. So you go like this, like that, and then you just chop, 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 chop. chop. And that. That's it, so I'll show it one more time. Go like this. Like this. So I'm just about to make my pounded jam and I thought I'll quickly show you how I do it. So I like to pour a bit of water to the side just in case. Actually, I'm going to pour a bit back in. I took a bit too much out. Always have some water in the kettle just in case you need to add some water. And then just add a bit of hot water. why I cover it is that it allows it to be really soft like when it's done it's mm, yeah it allows it to be very very soft and like easy to digest so that's how you know it definitely has been cooked well done very well yeah you've got to leave it to um for the steam to sort of do its work so I've let it do its thing for about five minutes and then you just mix it together can you see how soft it has become this is a good arm workout by the way This is my dinner, it's pounded yam, some okra with um, mushrooms and a bit of red onion and some tomato um, stew for the tomato. Making myself some green tea.
so I am rounding off for the night um, I just wanted to say because I had my friend over the other day who isn't a vegan and um, I was trying to persuade her just to go vegan for um, a couple of days just to see what it's like because she her percep her perception was that vegan food wasn't filling and it was quite boring and blah 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 so I made her a meal I'm, I'm sure you guys would have seen the video already but it was nice to know that I've kind of changed her perception a bit I'm not saying she's gonna go vegan but it was nice to see her satisfied with the vegan meal that I made so I was very very happy about that one thing I love about this lifestyle is that I can sort of eat whatever I want and you know oh, I just love it I love love honestly I'm just looking back to when I used to um like calorie restrict you know like when you have a really small amount just because you know you if you have too much then the pounds will pack on and it's so different now like looking back and thinking of how much I would eat to how much I eat now it's just a massive there's a massive massive difference and I'm just so happy that I came across this lifestyle and I'm looking forward to um, making more dishes and you know because I'm always because I'm a Nigerian I'm African so I'm always looking for ways to make my like uh, what, what I what I used to eat like vegan for cakes and stuff for my children they absolutely love it and I know like, it's nice to know that I know what ingredients are in there because obviously I'm the one that made it so it's really sort of inspired me I feel like starting like a bro and also it helps you emotionally as well I feel even though I'm going through a lot right now as in you know just dealing with life you know things that happen in life I still feel like I've got a big smile on my face I don't know if that's because I'm eating good food and you know my carb intake is up and you know I'm eating a lot of fructose and I don't know if if it correlates I'm sh I'm guessing it does you know but yeah I'm just gonna stop talking now and end it here um thank you very much for watching subscribe if you want to and see you guys next time bye